quick walk through on this since she's almost all ready. 24 volt eye pilot Minn Kota up front, bow mount. I'll never go back to a stern mount. This, this makes all the world of a difference up front. Run it all the way back to a pair of 100 amp hour tournament lithium 12 volts. These things are awesome. These last me all day. They Bluetooth to my phone. I wouldn't have it any other way now. <clears throat> back up here. Got the blue LEDs on the deck for the glow spoons. As I'm going out, I'll usually lay my spoons underneath there. It lights them up real well. Had the whites for a bit. Didn't really like the whites. I kind of like the UV uh, blue. Battery stored inside the hatch. Usually up there or off to the side. I got the Yak power control system down in here. Tied back there. Hard to see, but it's back there. Opposite of the Yak power control. Voltmeter, dual USB charger. On my right side, <clears throat> got my Lowrance sonar. Love this thing. Can see my downriggers down probably 100 plus feet on this. Dual rod holders, I usually run one dipsy and one rigger off the side, depending on the day. Sometimes it's two dipsies, sometimes it's two riggers. Now that I've got the rigger, on top of this wrap, I was all worried about it damaging it, so I just got a little piece of foam put it between the clamp and the wall so it doesn't damage the vinyl. Coming down the side, a couple of sponsors, POW Casting, Team Underdog, Cup Bait, Silver Salmon Challenge, Nick's the man for including us, giving us a kayak division. It's been on for a couple years now. There's really nothing else that's specifically for us, for salmon out there. A couple other people are trying now, which is great to see. Great to see the number of kayakers out there over the past few years. It's really picking up. Coming to the back, 360 light. Plugged into the act power. Got the salmon on the marine mat. See the kings in the background. New wrap looks awesome. Termit lithiums, love those batteries. The Hobie, the green in behind, bringing it up to the King Slayer. That's the kayak's name, in case anybody's wondering. And the bait fish with the We Will Fish On. We Will Fish On came from the COVID times. We were not going to stop doing what we do out there, no matter what. Nothing was going to stop us. When these kings hit, they put a lot of torque on these holders. <clears throat> I found these running boards on the sides. They get a little bit of flex to them, a little bit of bend, and I'm always worried they're gonna get ripped out. So, working a machine shop, I had one of my employees cut me some of these aluminum plates, and put them on here to kind of reinforce the stability of this thing, and then put the LEDs on the bottom underneath there. They make world of difference because I used to see a bit of a bow right here. Once the fish would hit and take off and pull on that. One more thing that's made a hell of a difference out there. This little sport umbrella. This thing helps keep the sun off you on those brutally calm hot days out there. Pivot 360 around there. Can pivot 360 up down there. Can pivot 360 there. So pretty much any direction you're heading, wherever that sun is, you can block it out.